I grew up in a hearing family, my parents are hearing, and that's an experience that comes with many challenges. My sister and my mom sign, my sister-in-law signs pretty fluently, and we can communicate pretty well, but other people in my family I can't communicate with hardly at all. You know, we have our system of communication that we developed growing up, but it's not fluent language. I went to the deaf school, so I was surrounded by deaf people, and my education happened in American Sign Language. I was able to really internalize the culture and the norms. And then I went to Minnesota for an internship, and I worked in accounting there. I got a job at Best Buy headquarters, which is actually what led me into this field. More and more people from other areas at the headquarters were really curious to learn about American Sign Language and deafness because I was the only deaf person who worked there. And they asked me to teach them some signs and things. And so at the beginning, during lunch breaks, I was just teaching people a little bit of sign language. And then all of a sudden, that informal lunch break sign language class grew and grew and became kind of overwhelming. I just looked at how the class had grown and how much I was enjoying teaching, and that's where I really found my passion for this. And so I decided to do it, and then I came here to Ohio. Um, and I went to graduate school here at Ohio State, and at the same time I started teaching American Sign Language classes, and I've been doing it for 14 years. I really enjoy teaching the students. Um, I mostly work with hearing students there, and just seeing their growth and their development and their signing skills grow is really wonderful. The ASL team, the department that we work with, is really great. We're able to be very innovative and creative with our lesson plans and our teaching strategies. It's a visual language, so everything in our classroom is visual. We show pictures, we use gestures, then we, little by little they pick up the formal signs and they start to learn the language. The hearing students that I teach, um, they're like sponges for deaf culture and deaf education and they really enjoy what they're learning and then I see them telling their friends and family members the interesting things that they're learning and that's the impact that I really like being able to have. I feel like I'm planting a seed and then I get to watch this flower bloom and then go out and, and spread that. So that's the thing I love the most which is why it's nice to be here.